Hello and welcome to my bathroom. <clears throat> we have volume all the way here. You can see that. Anyways, I'm Yolita Brilliant, owner, esthetician, massage therapist at Brilliant Massage Therapy in Burlington, Vermont. And today I wanted to make a video to talk about what is my skincare. And uh, it definitely changed after I graduated and got a licensed esthetician because you learn about ingredients. For me, it's not about the price, it's not about the name, it's not about anything besides the quality, what's the ingredients, how the product are made. So currently I use, for the most part, PCA skincare, which we also carry and do facials at Brilliant Massage. Um, also, I use Jane Ardell makeup. I still use a little bit MAC, that's my all time favorite of uh, like the big brand makeup thing, you know, name companies. And then um, actually, still use Proactive Toner because um, that frugal. I had a few of those, you know, I'm like, I feel bad throwing away and just switching everything to PCA right away, but I'm not going to buy it again. But, you know, toner is one of those things that as long as it's astringent, it has witch hazel, okay, it does the job as a toner. So as all the other products I use, like face creams and wash and all that, it's from PCA, it's really great. Um, and I still got a, got a couple products like lip products, moisturizers that are from a couple different brands. So um, what do I use from PCA? So my bathroom I, over there is like my big stash of stuff. So I'm gonna walk up here. Um, so, okay, so I used to have like a whole proactive care thing. I used to have that wash because I have oily skin on my pores if you don't exfoliate and if you don't uh, take care of my face skin, it gets clogged and then I'm a picker. I've been a picker since high school. I'm like 31 going on 32 in January, so. So I switched to a benzoyl peroxide 5% wash, which, um, you know, if sometimes like in the shower, I'll still use the, actually I lied, I still use the proactive wash as well because it's 2.5% benzoyl peroxide. And it's all about the um, ingredients, you know, and, and the strength. Yes, proactive has like some extra, like maybe things that I, whatever you know don't care don't not that great but active ingredient is good doesn't cause me any allergies or anything so I still kind of use that on occasion but other than that like I am fan of benzoyl peroxide so PCA has that wash and that's what I'm going for because that really works if you're acne prone but you know it's not just about benzoyl peroxide then I use other ingredients that are for anti um, blemishes, anti pore clogging, um, you know, and um, so I will do like exfoliating once a week with the pore refining treatment from the PCA. I don't know if it's not focusing really, um, which is really great. Uh, it's like beady, but the beads melt. And then I use intense clarity treatment. Um, 0 0.5 pure retinol at nighttime. I think this is what's been the most greatest thing to also get rid of blemishes, fine lines, and you know, make sure I age slower. Getting older after all, we all getting older. And then I'll put the Ideal Complex Eye Cream because I do get some little bit darkness around the eyes so this been good I really noticed the difference and then I'll put morning and night a clear skin which is wonderful because it has um uh it's not like um very it's not greasy you know all these products they're not clogging up pores and I have a brain freeze right now I can't remember the Gosh, the name of that active ingredient that this has. Um, I'll write in the 
in the section below more about so you can check that out. And you know, bef and then at night time and morning, I'll put also uh, serum. So right now, I've tried a couple different. Right now, I'm kind of stuck on the pigment gel with hydroquinone because I did have some like hyperpigmentation scarring from like the past acne that I had, you know, um, which I want to get rid of those little kind of darker scarred things on my face. So I don't have to put foundation as much. Um, and then I also use rejuvenating serum too for anti-aging. Uh, so I'll always make sure you cover your neck too because neck ages and some people forget to put that. So, so my kind of like two issues, you know, acne, you get like oily skin plus hyperpigmentation. So I've also been using uh, in conjunction with the pigment shell and the, the so this is only in the morning C and E advance uh, with hexyl serosinol and silymarin. This is, has like an interesting consistency and it can sting a little bit, but this is great for evening the skin tone as well. So this is the 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 king in the morning, the king May's most important thing in the morning, and then at night is the retinol. So those both things. You don't want to put them together because they just don't go that well. And also, I've been using the body therapy. Uh, this is uh, great for keratosis pilaris because it has like lactic acid, other brightening ingredients, kind of similar like the pigment gel, you know, kojic acid, all these whitening, brightening, so and clearing. So if you have chicken skin body therapy so I'll put those here right on my legs a little bit and it's also moisturizing too which is great um, and you know sunscreen perfecting broad protection 30 SPF PCA makes so many different great sunscreens it's not even funny but the 45, the water is using the active, the tinted, also the body tinted. I use that sometimes in summer because it gives you like already some brown, nice like a brown tan. Um, and it's not like a foundation, but you can use that on the face too if you want. And they have a like tinted eye cream too, but I don't have that currently. Let's see. And then also I've been incorporating my skin body you know for better cleansing and motivates me to cleanse better and the blue led you know supposed to help with clearing the skin the green it um helps with hyperpigmentation then they have multi setting and they have no light setting it does work like um ionoparesis and um it helps you draw the like serums all the ingredients better into your skin let's see did i forget anything i don't know and then, you know i cleanse my makeup currently off with garnier micellar water i am gonna probably upgrade a jr though well oops but oh no actually i don't think they have that they only have this mitten so which I tried, which I don't know if I like it because you have to wash it every time. It's like it really takes off the makeup without any um, cleansing. Makeup cleanser, you just use water and this. It's kind of crazy. But then it's like you have to wash it. It's just like, I don't know. It's, it's okay, but... But yeah, but other than that, so I do all that face, you know, put sunscreen and then I use my Jenner Del makeup, which I did today, you know, I use the, use the foundation, the liquid matte foundation that they just released. Then I do my, oh, where is that? Yeah, then I do my eyelash conditioner, which helps to grow lash just a little bit. Then I do my brows brow gel i do my um i, I use max eyeshadow primer then i do jane ardell's uh eyeshadow then i do jane ardell's mascara because it's not as an animal it's clean um 
you know, their brand is mineral based. And then I do, I, use, I love their um, trios they have like that highlighter, blush, and contour. I've been using this deep color. And sometimes I use this lighter color. They have like changeable, once you use it up, you just flip, add the new one into this. Kind of cool. Uh, you can use bronzer or anything. Oh, and I still use Max setting powder too. Like said that with Max. And I use NYX setting spray sometimes too. I kind of like the way this feels. And that has a great one too. Uh, and I love, uh, and I use Jen Ardell's lips. And I, um, let's see, yeah, so it's kind of like a little bit of mixture of everything. Um, I really love the clean lip products for Jennerdell, which is right now it's, um, I think it's the NYC color uh, for their um, moisturizing, volumizing, uh, like a lip product they have. Um, because you eat it you know so that's almost like i mean anything you put in your skin gets absorbed <clears> there's <throat> some it does it, it can actually show up in your bloodstream like 10 minutes after but um but the lips it's even more because you eat it let me see if i can pull this up i have this thing right here hello oh, i'm just joking i'm back so yeah, this one, this color I'm wearing. I'm sorry, it's Paris, not NYC. I'm still learning all the colors. So I just got this line to, we're selling in our store, Burlington downtown at Berlin Massage Serbian Skin. Oh, and I've been loving their um, eyeliner too, which is kind of cool. It comes like tip like this and it's just like, goes in here and you have this so it's awesome but this video is getting too long I'm gonna make another video maybe just on the makeups so thank you for watching let me know what you think I'll see you in the next video